market for a new laptop. I have a small Dell that I love, but the fan in it is, is in it inadequate and it's burning itself up. And I do download a lot of pictures and videos, so it's really important for me to have something that has a little bit of power and storage to it. Well, I did research online and came up with this 14-inch Dell, which is a refurbished one. But it's very heavy. Oh, the one that I have right now is not quite three pounds, and this is at least five pounds, if not a little bit more. What I liked about it was the fact that it was a 14-inch. My current one is an 11.6-inch, and I enjoy that size. I don't mind not having a big size. But this just is not working. Plus it's loaded with Windows 7, which we could have updated, but it just seemed very cumbersome and I didn't like the color resolution. So I've got the box and all the paperwork and everything and I will be returning this to Walmart this morning. Well, I'm back from Walmart and they were very gracious about taking that computer back and I got my money refunded real easily. I've heard a lot of people complain about Walmart, but our store is just has a fantastic uh, crew of people. They're friendly and very helpful. I've just never had any trouble with them. And, and even returning stuff, they're just really, really good. So I did just a couple of pieces of shopping there, and then I went to our bigger local grocery store. Um, at Walmart, I got a little notebook. I got the avocado uh, and the box of... Um, toothpicks so not much there at all the avocados were nice and big there and they were only like 98 cents so that's a good buy and then at the other grocery store I found a couple bargains this chicken is um, 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 3.78 pounds and it only cost three dollars and 29 cents so that's perfect for me I'm not sure if I'll roast it whole or if I'll cut it up and do stuff with it but that's it's just a nice size it's not too big and it's not too small once again, they are discounting some of their almost expired um, best by date lunch meats. And this is Seltzer Sweet Lebanon Bologna. I love that stuff. It was $2 a pound, and I got, a I got it for $1.40 for 0 0.70 pound, not quite three quarters of a pound. This is great on sandwiches or on crackers with cheese. So that was a really good buy. Also, they had some ground beef marked down. There were a number of packages, but I just got one. And the original price for this was um, $5.35. And then they had marked it down to $3.75. But I got it today for $2.79. And it's just a tiny little bit, um, let me see, under a pound. It's 0.94 pound. So... Anyway, I'll get a couple, at least a couple meals out of that. I wanted some enchilada sauce. I wanted some refried beans. I needed some freezer bags because if I'm going to put this in the freezer, I have to have something to put it in. Um, did I mention a couple bottles of Fago? And then they had a, a markdown basket, and they had this can of white clam sauce. I've never had it, but I thought, you know, for a dollar, it wouldn't be... You know, it would be a shame not to give it a try. So I got that. You know, it looks like they serve it on pasta, right? And so that's what I'll do. I've got some, oh, I've got some um, angel hair pasta and then some other, I think, penny. So for all of this, if I figured right, and as I said, you know, I could be wrong, I, it came up to $17.52. So I got some meat which is nice for the freezer. A couple canned goods, something to drink, a um, couple veggies, and you know, I, I think I'm related to the beaver family, how often I use a toothpick. So that's it for now. I'm going to be fixing my lunch to take it over to my neighbor's house, and we're going to have lunch together today, and maybe I'll um, let you see what we're eating, okay? Bye-bye for now. Hey guys, how are you doing this afternoon? I am here at my friend Joyce's place, and I hope she doesn't mind. I'm just going to do a tiny little scan because she's got one of the cutest kitchens you're ever going to see. She she redid it this year, right? Correct. This year. And her theme is, uh, I would call it an apple green for her accent pieces, and she did a beautiful job. She's, she's the lady that sewed those aprons, in case you guys haven't seen that video. 
She's extraordinarily talented, and she redid this counter. She's got the little basket, and this little guy right here, she just got the ninja, the um, oil carafe, the oil carafe, and all these cute little spice bottles. And then over here, look at this teapot. It's like a speckled hen. It's adorable. And then she's got her little uh, matching tool caddy and tools, the green and the yellow. Anyway, it is so cute in here. I want to respect her privacy and not show anything more. But we're having lunch together. And so she is having a turkey and Swiss on white with mustard. Yes. <laughs> And watermelon and some zucchini bread, and she is a tea drinker. And I'm having Fago Diet Root Beer and a Lebanon bologna sandwich with a little bit of ham and mayonnaise and mustard, potato chips, and a slice of zucchini bread. And that is what we're having for lunch. So, bon appetit, Joycey. Same to you, Steph. Thank you.